Okay, let's go. Probably the last episode, I assume. I mean, I'm gonna try to make it the last. It feels like the last. Is there more? I feel like there's more though, right? It's a manual, read a topic. I still didn't figure out recruits after all this time. Can I go back home too? I just cram everything into the closet, even the rug. Uh, my brain is fucking is fried. You ran the water fountain. It's a loop board. <clears throat> what the fuck is that me? Oh, that is me. I didn't even realize I had my finger on the up key. Teens own. I already been here, I think. <clears throat> you already been here? Hospital. Here to make an appointment? Nah, just here to hang out. I see. What is she playing? Is that a Game Boy Advance? Silver Drake. I've never beaten this boss before. Alright, hand it over, honey. I got this. No, Dad. This is my battle. So, um, how about just telling me what to do? Uh, sure. How about trying Fire Shock? I'd love to, Dad, but the mage left the party. Oh, yeah. How about one of your 99 Blaze positions? Um, I'm saving those? For what? Your birthday? Come on, live a little. Okay, Dad. This one's for you. Yeah. It reflects fire attacks. Ah, uh, whoops, hey, you gotta heal. Wish I knew healing magic in real life, then I'd make you better, and... It wouldn't just be me and mom. Your mother is... Hey, it's okay, sweetheart, I'm getting better. Might even be able to go to church tomorrow. Really? Are you sure you're okay? Holidays happen whether you like it or not. Even though everyone likes holidays. Well, gotta go home soon or mom will call. See you tomorrow, honey. Bye, dad. Love you. Susie, why are you here? Hell if I know. Damn, she didn't notice us? Sorry, guys. This game's only one player. Um, dad, this is, um, Susie. Oh, this is Susie. Susie, nice. Heard a lot about you. You, uh, have? Cool, think I have to go now. Susie, huh? Yeah, lay a finger on her and I'll kick your ass. What? Huh? Ah, uh, just kidding. Well, kind of kidding. What? What does that even mean? Aren't these students? Just take it easy. Sorry, I <laughs> used up a lot of my energy just now. Probably not going to be very fun to talk to. Thanks for visiting, though, Chris. And you too, Susie. Yeah, what is up with Rudy? Yeah, it seems like I need more tests. So just gotta wait it out. They can't keep me down for too long, baby. Sooner or later, I'm busting out of here. Besides, your dad ain't much without his main man. What? Who's dad? Is he mine? What is it, Christmas? Look, Chris, can't say much, but Noelle might look like she has it all, but her mother, her mother, you know, love her, but she's tough on her. Normally, I balance it all out, but I can't do much when I'm not there. I'm gonna get better. I have to. Well, then what is wrong with you? Hey, Chris, she's a nice girl. Huh? The hell are you talking to her for? Or, what? I can't fucking read. Why don't you take her to the movies? Hey, yeah, the hell didn't we go to the movies, Chris? 
Yeah, and take me too while you're at it. Yeah, Chris, come on. Kettle corn, Chris, big, don't skim out. Right. I just want to know what's up with, uh, wait, what is nothing, sir? Is, uh, health conditions. Yeah, get on out of here and do something fun. Patient's name, R Real Fruity Holiday. Okay. Hey, you forgot my name or something? No, I'm trying to look at what's going on with him. So why do you click creepy dolls? Hey, Noelle and her sister made that. Respect it. Noelle's sister? Hey, Chris, why are you checking the sink? That's what I'm asking, sweetheart. Whoa, the hell is bringing you flowers? Hey, what's wrong with a married man getting flowers? So your uh, wife gave them to you? Nah, ha ha ha. It must have been, uh, at, it must have been, um, Mr. Dreamer. I'm messing with you, Chris's dad did. Yeah, exactly. Not gonna try to understand this. Oh, who's this? Looks like she's resting her voice. You look inside the cupboard. A very small, obligatory piano is hiding inside. It's a classic 1 to 10 pain scale using ICS as a model. Here he's happy 10, he's happy and sweaty. It's a diagram showing a bunch of lines in a circle. I just wonder what they're gonna do with that situation like you know they already made it a pretty dire situation are they gonna have rudy pass away uh oh i'll this hell if i'm going any further i'm assuming not though i'm assuming he's gonna get better already close close enough to getting banned from school don't want to be banned from outside of school too that's a thing right no let's go into the police station Hey, get out of my road. Get out of the road. Uh, sorry, bad habit. Anything I could help you with, punk? Dark world. Huh? A super dangerous alternate world in the library? More are appearing. People might fall inside. Ha ah, listen, punk. You seriously think I'm gonna believe that? Dark world? Seriously? All right. Hey, hey, wait. Nah, not again. Looks like I gotta go recapture those criminals. Hey, by the way, that yellow glasses lady, is she your teacher? She kind of had an accident earlier with her uh, bike. Just wanted to make sure she was feeling alphas. So uh, give her this. I feel like she would know her though, right? Like what? You got a heart-shaped box of candies that says get well soon. It has to your bike hastily scrawled underneath the get well soon. What? So get well soon, all the store had. Open it and I'll arrest you. Look, even if put a note on it, I'll even put a note on it. Now stop interrupting me, I gotta go. Yeah, I can't even really read anyway, so I shouldn't even be talking. Oh, jailbreak. I'll sound the alarm. <laughs> Alright, man. I'm glad he's here. You skimmed the news article about undying new police chief undying's explosive de debut. Passionate young rookie becomes the new police chief. Too energetic. It'd be hard to live up to the legacy. After Asgore Dreamer was removed from the force, he was a police officer? There's no need to read anymore. What is happening in this world? Photos of Chief Undying and Deputy Nabstablu. Or Nabstablar. Undying is rescuing all of Caddy's family from a tree. Nabstablook is also stuck in the tree somehow. Oh, at least Nabstablook's in the game. He's a police officer too. Oh. I made a jailbreak alarm my mixtape. It's a nice beat to study or relax to while you escape from prison. True. Alright, that's cool. He's in the game. 
Anna Chris, do you have something for me? Uh, Ford chocolate. I'll give her some chocolate. Anna Chris, what is that you're giving me? A, a box of heart shaped chocolates? Whoa, whoa, no, I can't accept that from you. What? It's from the police? You mean she's giving me this? Um, uh, get well soon gift to my bike. And, uh, there's a note on this that says, Open this and I'll arrest you, you little punk. Chris, I... Tell her I, uh, appreciate it. Alright. There's more police tape. It says, yeah, I mean... It's not clear what is meant by that. It's a beaten bike. The horn looks like it might give a honk of despair. Alright, let's go. That is kind of sketchy, Susie. Uh oh, Alphys. Oh, okay, so it's not the police, it's the Alphys. Alright, alright, cool. Thought she was dodging the police station this whole time. <laughs> I just want to go home, but I'm still stuck in a traffic jam, even though it's only one other person. This is a great parking place. I can see myself settling down here. Oh wait, there is some stuff here. Here at Icy's Pezza, your family is going to love it. Icy's Pizza, your number one spot for a piping hot piece of pizza. Oh, is that burger? Burger pants? It is, little buddy. Aren't you gonna believe this? I've got a girlfriend. Azriel, you've got to tell Azriel right now. He's gonna be so proud of me. Huh? What's she look like? Ah, uh, little buddy, how do I put it? I don't actually know. I haven't met her in real life. Oh no, but from the way she texts, God, little buddy, she must be stacked. Uh, lie and say you want to hear more. I want to hear more. What? Stop conversation. I ain't lying like that. So far, she's the perfect girl, little buddy. She loves pizza. Sounds good. And bikinis, even better. And to top it off, she sent me a picture of herself wearing a pizza bikini. Oh, you tell me you don't want to hear this? Little buddy, perhaps it is uncouth, but look, look at this. Goddamn. It's several pixels that vaguely resemble a zoomed in JPEG of a pepperoni pizza. Yes, I know what you're thinking, little buddy. Her camera is not of the highest caliber. Don't give her money, please. But to a scholarly man of the world like myself, this is what love looks like, little buddy. Little buddy here to hear about my uh, girlfriend. Oh. That's right, we don't need to say anymore. Go ahead and tell Azriel right now. Try our new chocolate Pezza. Melts in your pants, not in your mouth. The pizza's sauce is boiling red. Bubbling, burning like my blood yearns for battle. Ha, ha. I, the warrior, shall show it the wizard's fists. Wow, my coworkers seem to seem so energetic lately. I don't know what's happening, but seeing him happy makes me happy too. Oh, a customer? Would you like a blue soft serve? It's a soda dispensing machine. He took a look at the flavors. Water, ice, double ice, red, flaming hot cheese soda, gamer blood energy drink, juice, red flavor, double ice pizza, great, ice wolf, big customer, ice wolf, oh ice wolf is in the game, ice wolf maybe only customer, that's cool, they gave ice wolf a uh, a cameo that's cool and burger pants whoa go in there if you want but i'm staying here caddy's wondering or caddy's working there today she hates me so what if i took jock boy's hat once it i looked cool jockington fans they're crazy man 
talking to fans. Chris, going. I am trying to go in by myself. I would love to go in by myself. Just ignore them. I know. They're embarrassing. Why are they even here? Oh, without fail. Hold on. Oh, he's got to get some kind of message or alarm. Because they care. Your family is weird. Oh, her family is here. For what? I'm so, so confused though. Why are they here? I mean, they are acting up though. Like, this is a diner. Your family is weird. I know. Wish they'd be normal. Or at least... More goth. <laughs> what? What? What's wrong with that? Pure boy, heart of gold, curiosity high, intelligence low. Fetches frisbees, dress him up, carry in a bag, precious boy. Don't know why. Oh, so she really likes Jockington. I guess it's the fan club? Noel. Golden hair, starry eyes, she is the light, laughing in the night, taught her protection spells, showed her occult findings, but lately she slips into the darkness. Chris, you walk among the dark, protect her. From Susie. I'm talking about Susie. Uh, family. Wait, did I do this? Dad, mom, sister, ukulele, football games, soap operas, yelling, standing on tables, afraid of vacuums, stupid loud, very loud. Chris, you and I studied occult together. We did? Incantation for silence. Find it. Tell me. You tell the truth. I thought this was the post office. Oh, to tell you the truth, but by the time I realized, I'd already sat down. I like the, the way this character looks. I'm not hungry, but I've just been telling the waitress I'm still deciding for a few hours now. How am I supposed to get out of this one? Just tell him you change your mind, walk up and leave, and then go to the post office. It's That's all you have to do. Woo, caddy, you go, girl. Show those customers who's boss, little lady. Yeah, this is not like... I mean, I don't know how it goes in Delta Run, but... They probably would have been kicked out by now. Kick their tush. Woo, beat them down. You got this. Our little caddy. She's doing us proud. Working hard. Supporting us. Oh, damn. She's supporting you guys. Serving us pickles. Terrifying us with their shape. Trying to get us to leave. Proud of her. Yeah, caddy's awesome. She's definitely um, everything I thought she would be. Caddy's family is always asking when her next shift is so they can come in and cheer her on never seen anything like it but it's kind of nice isn't it i don't know if you noticed but i've been getting stronger you could say i'm bulking up for the winter this guy's next to me he's really bulked up i admire that omg my little sis is so cute in her outfit chrissy like listen to the song i made about her Caddy's the best, Caddy's the best. She curses me every day, glares cause I'm in her way. Caddy's the best sister ever. Ah, uh, anyway, what's up Chrissy? OMG, Chrissy, you're not going to believe this. I was at the beach playing ukulele, right? Like, that green alligator, evil neighbor girl, like, invaded and started like playing my song. With me. Who? It was so fun. Ha, uh, wait, isn't she like my enemy? What, evil invader girl? I was at the beach. Oh, damn. I want to know, tell me. Green alligator. Oh, okay, uh, Caddy's friend. Braddy, right? Where's Braddy? I guess she's in the game though, technically. Caddy's my friend, at least, at least by description. Caddy's my friend and I support my friends through thick and thin. What is he doing? <laughs> Long and short, cold and hot, whatever shape the world takes, I'll be there. Jockington seems cool, Caddy seems cool. I should be hanging out with these people. 
And Caddy hates her. Yes, Caddy hates Susie. I love Caddy. Cat. There's a cat flap. It's locked somehow. It's a broken grill. It smells like burnt cat food. There's some kind of scratching noise coming from the inside. Is this like a cat neighborhood? There's some kind of scratching and hissing from inside. Oh, hey, frog it. Ribbit, ribbit. I sometimes hear beautiful singing from that house over there. How eerie. Could it be a ghost? My brother's too old to take for a walk anymore. Brother. Wait, is that the bunny girl's, like, is that the little bunny that grew up? I'm aimless. Wish I had someone to whip me into shape. He's too old to take for a walk anymore. Knock, knock. What, what, what? If you're looking for Blooky, they aren't here. Unless you're looking for someone else? Uh, I'm looking for you. Me, me, me? What have I got to say to you? Nothing. I could even recognize a pathetic face like that. By the way, say hi to your dad for me. Wait, wait, don't do that. He doesn't know I... nothing. I don't even know who this is. I'm assuming it's one of the ghosts. Uh, someone else. Fine, fine, fine. Wanna talk to someone else? Here. Oh my, someone's here to see me? It's you again, is it, darling? Darling. Sounds like, um... That Neo guy, I forget his name. The robot. Oh my. Or Android? I don't know. Why do you keep coming to our door? Are you a fan of mine? Ha ha ha, as if someone could be a fan of a nobody like me. Well, if you are a fan, haha, ha, could I bother you for a favor? Since the internet went down, I haven't had much entertainment. Do you have anything entertaining, darling? Could you bring it by to me tomorrow? It would mean the world to me. Thank you. Tomorrow? Is that like for real? Okay, what if we say no? Nope. Then leave, leave, leave. I wanted to buy flowers, but the store's closed. The door around back's unlocked, but I don't think I should go in. Closed. Which is where my dad works, right? In the flower shop? It's your dad's truck, yeah. The floor of the front seat is littered with old papers and country CDs. It's your dad's truck, okay. So, is he out? I guess. Out for lunch or something, maybe? I don't know. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Listen up. See that weird circle on the beach? Yesterday I waited on it, and something weird came out. Of course it's not yesterday anymore, so too bad. Wait here? It's not yesterday. I wonder if this game has an internal clock or something. Just like a secret one. Because it's talking about tomorrow and yesterday, but I don't think, like, I think they're just saying that so it doesn't appear. It's an ornate gate. It appears to be locked. Chris, you going home? Not yet, huh? Um, sure. All right. I don't think there's anything else to do, though. It's your mom's van. I'll talk to everybody. 
think. I hope. Alright. Then, guess it's goodbye for today. See you tomorrow, Chris. Chris, how is studying with your... Why, Chris, is that your friend? Why don't you invite her inside? Uh, uh, I mean, I, uh... Chris, I should, um, probably get going, and... I was going to bake a pie. Don't you want any? Guess I can come over for a bit. Yeah, what are you tripping? Just come over. Feel free to come in. Oh, excuse me. I am Chris's mother, Toriel. Y yes, ma'am. I remember. Oh, you do? And you are Susie, are you not? Huh? You, you um, remember my name, too? Of course, Miss Alphys is a good friend of mine. She often talks about you. I'm glad to hear it. Chris, the hell is Alphys saying about me? Susie, why don't you wash your hands over there? Then we can make a pie together. Make it together? Uh, but I don't know how to. Don't worry, I can teach you. Okay. Chris, Susie seems like a nice girl. I am very happy you are friends with her, but... Chris, I heard from Alphys about her behavior. If by any chance she er, influences you, or er, leave the chalk alone, alright? Is that like a metaphor for drugs or something? <laughs> Hands uh, washed. Wonderful. Now we can... Oh, Chris. How about you show Susie how to bake it? Chris, you know how to make pie? The hell haven't you made me any then, dumbass? You pie hoarding piece of... Yeah, she's really nice, mom. I mean, uh, excuse me, ma'am. Susie, you can just call me Toriel outside of school. Okay, sweet. Huh, Chris? Oh, you need to wash your hands too? Then I suppose I shall teach Susie for now. Susie and I will start getting ready to make the pie. Uh, we will. Wait. Alright. Because the TV looks like it's plugged in, but it's dusty. It's Cheriel, the beloved living room chair. How are you leaving me here with your mom? Is this like a what's it called an introvert thing? I was just trying to see if there's I could examine this book. It's a book of Himes. Okay. It's a landline phone, but you already have a cell phone. Yeah. This trash can somehow it's emitting a pleasant floral scent. There's a photo on the fridge. It's of you, your mother, and your brother. Brother. It's a sink. You could wash your hands here. But isn't the sink in the bathroom better? Mm hmm. She's sneaking sugar right out of the bag. Susie? What? My pie, my rules. Got it. She's sneaking sugar? Or she's eating pure sugar out of the bag? Hey, what are those metal people shapes in the cupboard? Like uh, handcuffs for a little guy's whole body? Haha, ha, those are for gingerbread, Susie. Gingerbread men and gingerbread monsters, of course. Gingerbread monsters, huh? Cool. Seems like, uh... Foreshadowing? Cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters and gingerbread humans. Oh, they're just cookie cutters? Gingerbread sounds like something Noel would like. Hmm. Noel? Uh, nothing. I mean, I wish I could see what these things look like. Chris, no sneaking ingredients until you wash your hands. Don't worry, Chris. I'll sneak stuff instead. I mean, did Susie wash her hands, Mom? Like... It's a sink. You could wash your hands here. But isn't the sink in the bathroom better? Just do it here. 
It's the bathroom sink. Will you run the tap? Sure. Started to run. It's making a lot of noise. Uh... Well, let us get the flower. So that's the bag and you just, oops. Hey, Susie, you have flower on your nose. Uh, I meant to do that. Thought you would stop to smell the flower, eh? Ah, I, I chew, come on. Now on to the next part. So where the he uh, heck is Chris? Oh, Chris, er, does this sometimes. Well, they should hurry. I'm getting sleepy. Do you know what they call a, call a sleeping Susie? Huh, what? They would call her a snoozy. Uh, haha, -ha, then. And I guess you'd be a snorio. Ha 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 ha, snorio. Snoozy and snorio. Yo, where's Sans at for this? Uh, you really like that one, huh? Wasn't it funny? Alright, where the hell is Chris? Toriel? The pie is nearly done. Oh, the sugar. Wait here a moment. I left it in the car. hands are clean all right well at least he washed his hands i don't know what he did but at least he cleaned his hands afterwards i hope he cleaned it afterwards and not before you know no need for it but it said he said his hands are clean the apple scented shampoo feels lighter than usual all right let's go hey chris hurry up next time we're already almost done. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, you should have checked on a, a Chris here if uh, you told him to just wash his hands. So what's next? Oh, er, the pie. We already worked quite hard, have we not? How about we finish up later? Or finish it later? Um, okay. Then, uh, guess I'll walk home? Oh, no, no. There's no need to do that. Oh, actually, Susie. Would you like to stay over? Huh? I mean, um, if it's okay, then... Here, look at this. Our couch is used to being used as a bed. It's not perfect, but we could all sleep out here. That sounds good to me, yeah. Splendid, we're all gonna sleep on the couch together. Splendid, I will make sure everything is in order. Or are we using those chairs back there too? Just call your parents. Will you not? Yeah, of course. Did she, did she call her parents or does she not have parents? I want to know that. I want to know like Susie's situation. 
So what the hell, a sleepover? Damn, I haven't had one of those in forever. <laughs> oh. Hey, Chris, it's not like someone has to tell you to sit, right? I'm not- I, this is my fucking house, okay? There, chill out for a second. For a sec. So now what? I got it. Maybe between the pillows here. There. Knew I'd find the remote in there. You always find good stuff wedged in the couch. Jeez, it's dusty. When's when do you last use this thing? Well, who cares? Let's just watch TV. So what are we gonna marathon tonight? Who said we're marathoning stuff on the TV tonight? Blood Crushers 3? Hell, Blusters, Invasion of the Cat Petters? Maybe I see the movies more your speed, huh, Chris? Ha 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 I thought we were going to play like video games or something. I guess we don't have any. It's been a good day, huh, Chris? You, Rossi, Lancer, everyone. It's just cool hanging out together, right? That's why, you know, don't you think we should try to have them come to our world? Come on, think about how much better it would be. I'll say could do our homework. Lancer could live under your bed. We could all walk to school together. Okay, you are getting a little bit too attached to me right now. It'd be perfect, you know? I mean, we'd be unstoppable is what I'm saying. Why do I have to say yeah? Like, I want to say no. Seems like a little far-fetched. Oh, my stomach is going crazy right now. Um, no, I don't want to put them in, uh, our world. I don't know what's going to happen to them. Seems a little far-fetched. What? Come on, it'd be easy. Ralsei looks like your mom, right? Just say he's a long-lost cousin. It'd be easy. Just lie to my mom. You want me to lie to my mom, Susie? Lancer could even make him a fake mustache. Well, whatever. Let's just get back to watching. I mean, I guess my mom was right about the influence part. So the festival is coming up, right? That thing where the town becomes a carnival? Stupid, right? I mean, that sounds pretty cool. But say you had to uh, take someone. Noel or Ralse. Uh, Ralse? To the carnival? What? Why are you saying it so confused? What? It's not like I meant anything weird. I'm not. You know what? I forget it. Look, let's just go back to watching TV. You don't, you're the one who started talking to me. <laughs> now this is what I'm talking about. A giant monster movie special. Always like them better than the giant human movies. Now this is something we can marathon. Are you ready, Chris? For 12 hours of building, bashing, car crunching action. Because we are locked in. Got it? Better not see you move until I'm moving. I gotta fucking do shit. Until your eyes are bloodshot. <laughs> now let me just get comfortable here and there. Susie fell asleep. Officer, officer. What, did I commit a crime when I left? Thank goodness I finally got through. I thought I saw someone prowling around outside and then I checked our car. The tires look like they've been slashed. Officer, if you could please come over. You will soon. Thank you. Did I slash our tires when I left instead of washing my hands? It's like a... Uh, defiling our own car they're already asleep i guess i want to see what that looks like dang she can i don't get how people can sleep sitting up like that i can't do that i've seen people do it before though so i mean like i think my father 
does that sometimes. But then they usually falls on the floor uh, when I was young. It usually doesn't end well. And stuff gets broken. Oh shit, it's over. Delta in chapter 2. Oh my goodness. I did it. Oh, I made it through. Fuck. I mean, that was alright. If I have to be honest, um, if there's, there is plenty of stuff in the game I did enjoy, but there's also stuff that was like, I, it could have done without, um, and I think there was too much talking, but I mean, all the games have that, I don't know, I just, I feel like this talking was a little bit different, this talking, it felt like they were trying to, uh, I don't know, it felt more like preachy, you know, like they were trying to get me to, uh, like Susie and all that stuff. It's like, um, okay, all right. So it's just saved here. Seven chapters. I don't know, but that kind of did. I don't know about like the length, but that felt a little shorter. I don't know about you guys, but the beginning felt like a long time. It felt like a good time too. Like, man, I miss Lancer. I even miss the King. Like, you know. But I guess this is going to go on for a long ass time. So I will try and stick around for as long as I can, guys. Uh, yeah, this is going to last forever. I don't know how this is going to end, though. I just hope it ends um, in, like, an enjoyable way. I, I would rather just take, like, either a sad ending versus, like, I don't know. Sad, happy type ending. But yeah, um, I guess that's it. It just exited the game for me. But let me load it up again, because there's always secrets and stuff like that. Let's see. Okay, it just shows this. Play, do not. Let's see what happens. Once upon a time, okay. Let's skip this. That's it. it looks like there may be more honestly though the the sprite work and like like the even this little screen here all this stuff menu select screen intro everything it's so nice it's so like uh i don't know filled with like like passion it just looks so so good you know for uh pixel art i love it there's a lot of stuff i like but I guess just a little bit less talking. Yeah, I think that's what mostly it was. But I don't know. It's it's more like the forced conversations too. You know, it's not like I I'm going up and talking to people. It's like I'm forced to sit here and talk and listen and 
and do these cut scenes you know and it's like sometimes these characters like i like some i like a lot of these characters but some of these characters i'm just not a fan of so but i mean that's just how it is uh but yeah thanks for sticking around i might as well just i'll just leave it like this uh thanks for watching if anyone didn't know i was pretty much high out of my mind most of this uh most of the time sometimes i wasn't so high because i actually i did a i did a um episode i think episode two and i got way too high i couldn't even finish i didn't know what was even happening so i had to like slow down on that and i'm i'm i'm, I'm like i'm just a little high just so i could finish this i started to lose the plot at some point but yeah i'll catch you guys in the next one thanks for watching and uh if I start posting other stuff, uh, please check that out. All right, thanks. Take care. Bye.